All right, let's go. Um, D Street, um, CCI. Been getting a lot of texts, a lot of messages, uh, messages, a lot of comments on the market and what's going on now. Um, and how do you deal with the market when it goes into the red? Um, meaning down, the market is down. Um, it's all fine and dandy when the market is going up, 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 everybody's making money. But every now and then it corrects itself or even crashes. I'm about to show you, I'm going to show you what a crash looks like. Um, I'll show you what a crash looks like. And then you can make the determination for yourself um, after I show you. So here, so here, here we go. Let's see if you can see this. See if we can make this a little bigger. So here we go. Here's here's the Nasdaq. I'm just looking at the Nasdaq, and here's the Nasdaq. That's today. That's like it's actually going back up. But here, I'm going to show you a few times where it corrected itself or, or where it, where it crashed, and we're going to make. Um, I'll show you a few times where it corrected itself, where it crashed, and then let's look at it and see what happened after it, it, it corrected itself or crashed. So look, if we go here, this is COVID. This is COVID. We all know what happened with COVID. COVID it crashed. It, it, went, it went down all the way down, we traced all the way down to here. Then if you if you follow it. That was March 23rd. Then it started going back up. March 26th, March 30th, April. By the time we got to May the 29th, it was already higher than it was before. That's COVID. One of the worst things we ever saw happen <laughs> in the world. This is what the market did. It retraced all the way down, uh, maybe 30, 40 points. Let, let's say 40. Let's say, yeah, maybe 40 points. Then March, maybe a month and a half, it was higher than it was. Maybe a month and a half, month and a half, two months. It was higher than it was before. You can see that right there. So let's look at other times when it, when it actually goes in the red. So right here, it went in the red. It retraced down maybe 15 points. We call these these corrections 15 points it dipped down here 15 points but if you count if you so you can count the days it was one one two three four five six six days it was in the red then green then it started back up green 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 so now let's count where we currently are because this week has been a rough week uh it's been green one, red one day green one day red red and green again and red red Maybe five days in the red, with some green actually sprinkled in there. These are days. Each week is a day. So if you get the gist of what I'm saying, COVID, the market, if you can see it, it goes down and up, down and up, down and up, on its way up. That's October 2018, September the 20th. It goes down and up, down and up on its way up. And if you have a world catastrophe right here, COVID, everybody going crazy, lost their money, people jumping out of windows. In a month and a half, two months, it'll be higher than it ever was before. So what I do when the market goes in the red, keep cash, and I buy everything that's low. Buy everything that's low or also nothing. <clears throat> the market is never all the way down. The market is never all the way down. There's always something that's striving due to the current, uh, current situation. You either find those things or you keep cash and buy everything that's low. It's as simple as that. The market will always be bailed out because our whole economy is in the market. So eventually it will correct itself. The fear of the market dying, um, it has crashed a couple of times. It crashes and then it rebounds every time. That's how it happens. Um, the worst one we've seen was right here and it rebounded in a month and a half. So the whole fear of the market 
dying, you losing your money. No, your money will go down. Well, like Warren Buffett say, patient people. The market is where patient people take money from impatient people. You just have to stay the course. Look at money different. It's the way you see money. We're used to making money every two weeks. Then we pay our bills, then make it every two weeks. It's like, like, like being on crack. Back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Patience. It's the way you see money. Stay the course. Just remember the market goes down, comes back up. Always higher than it went down before. This is time. This is time to dollar cost average down. Meaning, if you got a stock at five dollars, now you can buy it at three dollars. You buy it at three dollars. Now it's four dollars. It's time to do all of that. The market. When, just thinking like this: when the market is down, everything gonna sell. Sabogo, CCI, and Daryl Street. 